I just had a nightmare recently. I will tell you all about it now. It's 2025 and I am an American, a legal American citizen. Which is good and I also, and in the year 2025 I also achieved the dream of becoming a movie director. But not a good one. I, in 2025, am referred to as the worst movie director ever. Let me explain this. On Internet Movie Database, there isn't a single movie that has more than two stars on average rating. Believe me, that's not the worst part. Also, most of my movies have received awards in the worst category. You might think, well, that sounds bad. That's, that has to be the worst part about the nightmare. No, 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 it's not the worst part. Being known as being the worst movie director ever is very bad. You know what the worst part is? I saw myself as an evil movie director. You know, what I see it in a dream, I just do like, ha 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 look at all those fools. They really are foolish enough to get more, get me money. I don't give a shit about any of those movie fans. I used to be a big movie fan myself. But it's a lot more fun making quick buck by making terrible movies. I don't give a shit if my movies are terrible or not. I'm not going to try to improve myself. Those fools are foolish enough to pay to see my movies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I said some shit like that as a movie director. That, my friends, is the worst part. You know what that means? I will tell you what it fucking means. It means that in the nightmare, I wasn't even trying. In that nightmare, I was just a, I was a movie director who only cared about the movie and not movie fans. And most critics and movie fans are like, do look at me like the worst movie director ever. Oh. That is a big problem. Do you know what? It felt real. I'd say that dreams are me are one magical thing. Because dreams can make us feel like something we are dreaming about is real. And for most of my dreams, I feel like I'm really there. And seeing myself as the worst movie director ever, and not giving shit about it, 
That's just an awful, awful nightmare. So, here's a question to you guys. Do you think this nightmare is accurate? Do you think the nightmare I had recently is accurate? If it is accurate, what can I do to me to prevent that nightmare from becoming a reality? Tell me, what can I do? Well, maybe this nightmare was a bit over the top. Why would I become someone who doesn't give a shit about anything but money? That's unrealistic. This, this nightmare could come true. But it could also be a warning to me. That's what I have a feeling about. I have a feeling that that nightmare I just had is a warning. So what's your opinion on that nightmare I just had recently? I really want to know what you think this nightmare means. Normally, I don't push, I don't talk about dreams I just had. Well, okay, we'll take that back. I did make a lot of videos about what was happening to me in Emerald City. But this isn't about that. This nightmare is about me being known to be the worst movie director ever. The nightmare could be real, but it could be a warning. The nightmare could be a warning on something that could... It could be a warning on something that's happening to me in the future. So, please, I want other people to tell me. What do you think about this nightmare? Do you think it's true? Do you think it's completely... Do you think it's completely... Fake? Do you think it could be a warning or something? Leave your thoughts in the comment section. That's all I gotta say. Thank you for watching and have a great day.